What is up everybody, it's your boy back at it again with another video. Today we're gonna actually be doing something very interesting. Now I asked you guys earlier if um, you wanted me to check out this German restaurant. Now it's gonna close in the next hour and a half, so we're gonna actually book it over there and check this out. I have no idea what the menu looks like, I have no idea uh, what options they have, and I'm not even sure if it's very authentic. So that's why we're gonna go over there and check it out. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. If you're a returning viewer, welcome back. Welcome back, join the guild, join the break gang, and all that fun jazz. I'm rushing out of here. I don't have very much time. Let me go make sure I got all my all my things with me. I'm very excited, man. I know I, I sounded like I was in a rush earlier because I really was. Like this place literally closes in one hour. I didn't even realize it closed so early. So I guess they have two different times that it's open. It's called the, Schn the Schnitzel Lodge. So the Schnitzel Lodge is open from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. and then 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. So basically breakfast and lunch time and uh, basically dinner time. I'm very curious to see what the, what options they have. I didn't really look too deep into it. I just know that my friend told me that it was a German restaurant and you already know how I feel about that, man. I gotta exercise my Deutsch culture, you feel me, before I go out there and actually experience the real deal thing. Now I know a lot of you guys are gonna be like, wow, nothing beats the original food, nothing beats the motherland food, the, the actual home food of uh, Deutschland, so I, I understand that, but you know, if we can find a place that gets as close as humanly possible, then um, I'll take that, I'll, I'll honestly take that. But this is for you guys, you told me you wanted me to do a quick vlog on this uh, German restaurant, so um, I'm very interested, man. I'm very interested to see what options they have. I need you guys to let me know in the comments down below um, what each of these things are on the, I guess, on the menu and stuff like that. Like, if it's a popular dish in Germany, and if the pricing is right, is it, is it cheaper in Germany? Is it uh, cheaper here? Just let me know. Be honest. So I'm here at the Schnitzel Lounge. I'm gonna see if you can see the, the sign really quick. There it is. I go from there. I'm really excited. I'm hungry. I kind of brought an appetite today. I'm fasting so I can like, you know, lose a little bit of weight, but pretty curious. Let's check this out and see how it goes. So I'm sure a lot of you guys have questions and that's honestly why I'm here. To kind of start off, this restaurant, this menu that I have right here actually was the general menu and whatnot. You can choose to order your food and have it, you know, prepared for you. Or there was actually a buffet readily available. So you can, you know, grab whatever you wanted from the buffet, already cooked food, and they were actively cooking food in the back. And it was actually re really good. It smelled very delicious. And there was a, a wide variety of an assortment of food. So what you guys saw on my Instagram, where you guys are like, oh my God, I would never combine all that food together. That was literally me picking what I thought looked appetizing and trust me it tasted really good really wow. good um totally worth every penny in fact the pricing was amazing it, and i i got a full course meal all you can eat for literally the same price that i would spend to buy a burger from like a local burger restaurant it was actually really good really good all right so we're here in the restaurant and it's actually pretty cool i'll kind of show you guys what it looks like a little bit um <laughs> you got like later hosen on the wall which is pretty cool and then I guess like the great and then this is the restaurant and then of course uh, for me I got uh, Kind of a variety of stuff. Obviously, you guys told me to try schnitzel, so that's what I have here. Um, schnitzel. Uh, I think it, this is a potato pancake, um, pretzel. This is, uh, I think it's called a salad, a worse, a worse salad. To be honest, I'm not even sure if I pronounced that right. Um, pork, and then I have bratwurst, like actual bratwurst, not like the stuff that I tried to cook. But I get an A for effort, right? I mean, it kind of looked like what it was supposed to be, I uh, guess. <laughs> and then a pretzel, and I think this is just green beans, but it's really good.
so good. I got like another plate. Really, really, really good. I think I'll definitely be back for sure. I know like um, all my friends and stuff are telling me about this place and it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. Like look, this is, this is like plate number two. I know I'm not the most aesthetic when it comes to taking like, you know, shots and stuff, but this is really good. Really good. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Basically, I got like applesauce because, you know, me, I like apples. And then brochen, um, bratwurst, and then I think there's green beans behind here. And then obviously schnitzel. Schnitzel. See? Boom. I'll actually show you guys like what it looks like and stuff. It looks very traditional, really good place. Um, love the atmosphere. I can't wait. Like I said, it's open between 11 a.m. and 2 p.m. and then 5 p.m. and um, 9, uh, 9 p.m. So I think it's actually about to close in a little bit. I'm gonna finish eating my food, so. And guys, we are out. Well, we did it. And it was really good, really, 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 really good. This is beautiful. Food was amazing. I'm definitely gonna be back for sure. Schnitzel House, man. Really, really good food. And the, the crazy thing is, it actually didn't cost very much at all. It was like the same amount of money I would have spent to, to get maybe like a burger from McDonald's, but I got an entire meal for the price. So very, very, very excited. And I'm definitely quenched for sure. You guys saw the food that I got. Very hearty, man. Very hearty meal. And I know a lot of you guys probably have like, you know, questions and stuff. Let me know in the comments. I probably should have been more descriptive when I was eating, but when I'm eating, I am in the zone. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, just wanted to kind of show you guys. Like I said, this is the Schnitzel House, and it's very traditional. You walk in there, and I felt like I was in um, a completely different country, man. I know it sounds crazy, you know, I mean, you guys are probably, probably rolling your eyes and stuff, but it actually felt like I was in a different country. Uh, service is really good. The lady was very nice, very beautiful, and um, I don't know, I loved it. Loved it, loved, loved every aspect of it, man. So, um, if you guys ever are in Florida and stuff like that, want to hang out and kick it, this is definitely one of the spots you guys want to hit up for sure, for sure. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in and everything. You already know what it is. Send me some, some more suggestions actually in the comments down below um, for music, for other links to check out and whatnot. I'm practicing my Deutsch, so should be a little, uh, you know, whatever. But anyways, um, yeah. I don't know. I'm kind of shook because the food was really good, man. I'm, I'm about to sleep good today, bro. I ain't going to lie. <laughs> I'll see y'all later, man. Take care. Peace. Hey, what's up? Did you guys subscribe to the channel? Did you subscribe to the channel? Ah, oh, well, if you haven't, make sure you do that. Also, we do have a Discord. The Discord link is always gonna be in the description down below on any of my videos, and it's dope. What we do on Discord is pretty simple. A lot of you guys are, I'm collecting you guys from a bunch of different countries, a bunch of different places, and you guys wanna teach me a whole bunch of stuff. You guys can join the Discord and teach me anything. You can send me any kind of messages and stuff. You can actually post memes. You can participate in the community and just make friends. Just go ahead and join the Discord and see what, how, what, what kind of situation you're getting into for yourself. Also, there's going to be some giveaways in the future. There's going to be some giveaways. But to create some incentive for that, I need you guys to follow me on Instagram. Are you guys following me on Instagram? You know what my Instagram looks like? You probably don't know what my Instagram name is. Uh. <laughs> It's right there. Just go ahead and check it out. Check it out. Check it out. It, it's dope. Uh, just follow me on Instagram. I, I do live streams every day. I try to, you know, engage with you guys in every way possible. I know a lot of, a lot, not a lot of creators are very engaging with their fan base. I try to be engaging. So just go ahead and check it out. There's no, no harm, no foul. Follow me on Twitter too. I honestly am trying to grow my Twitter, <laughs> but I don't really post that often on there. But when I do, you guys will be the first to see whatever post those will be. You know what I'm saying? Now, if you guys want shout outs or whatever, I don't know a lot of, we have a lot of upcoming independent artists that have been hitting me up as of late i might create a series where i get i favor my international independent artists and stuff and i might promote you guys for free but just it might just be one or two a week you know I and mean, you guys can give me some feedback on that but all to say follow me on my social medias all right if you guys aren't doing that already you need to do that because that's a pretty big deal <laughs> i'll see you guys later but enjoy the content i create it's gonna be random uh reaction videos a lot of a lot of everything reaction videos vlogs, challenges, cooking videos, gaming videos, anything you guys suggest when you join my Discord or message me on Instagram. But I'll see you guys soon. Take care, follow me. Peace!